Framingham State University recently invited author Tressie McMillan Cottom to speak about her book, Lower Ed, How For-Profit Colleges Deepen Inequality in America. Through her research and, and first-hand experience like, as an admission yeah, counselor at a for-profit institution, McMillan Cottom describes a system that can take advantage of people trying to find a way out of low-wage employment and how the government feeds an unfair system that disproportionately affects minorities. The author helps decipher the benefits, pitfalls, and real costs of a for-profit education. Whether you attend a non-traditional or for-profit college or not, you are still involved in for-profit colleges, it still has something to do with you. I think the question that we are not trained to think about a lot, and that that's because it didn't used to matter as much as I think it matters now and will increasingly matter in the future, is are the credits I earn here transferable? Because that actually tells you a lot. If they can transfer to other places, that tells you that it's probably not for profit, certainly tells you that it's accredited, probably gives you an idea of how people will perceive your degree because if people are willing to take your credits, it's because they think the institution you went to was a high quality institution. By and large, when you catch them when they're enrolled, students are satisfied with their for-profit college. That changes a bit once they leave and they have to start repaying and they rethink what they invested in it. And this is why we have community colleges, um, is they can take the credit hours and they can help students figure out the bureaucracy and the paperwork. I would like the, uh, the community to know that these are community problems and challenges, but they're not insurmountable if the community pays attention to them. Um, I, I think I like, I hope that at the end of my book, um, uh, uh, Lower Ed, The Troubling Rise of uh, For-Profit Colleges in the New Economy, I really, it can be a depressing story, but I hope at the end, um, what I left with is are things that people can do.